Today's video is sponsored by Bearskin Hoodies. Well, you want to grab yourself coffee and have a seat because I think this video is going to be all over the place. I believe we're going to go cut some wood. We're going to go look at a Christmas tree. We're going to look at some Christmas lights. And we're going to go cut down a Christmas tree. Oh, and we're going to talk about this hoodie. Good morning and welcome back to another one. We are headed out to the farm today. We got to cut some wood. Uh, as you have mentioned before, my daughter Erica is getting married on Saturday. And she wants some wooden discs or centerpieces on her tables. So I'm about to meet up with Farmer Paul. He's got some trees down. We're going to cut some wood. So the parade is done. Everybody now goes to the park for the tree lighting. And all these trees in here, all of them, all got lights on them. They always do a good job. Well, we have made it to get our Christmas tree out here at Sloan's in Bothwell. 
I uh, must say, it is slim pickings. It is raining. And we want to get it before the, well, before the thunderstorm comes. If indeed it does come. So there is not much out here. It has been picked over bad. And it's only roughly near the end of November. You see what I mean? That field over there is empty. Plus the one on the other side of that is empty. This has all been picked over pretty good. These ones here are all young trees. I certainly hope we find something here. It's got to be a Douglas fir. They last the longest. You know, I got my bearskin hoodie on. It is raining. Wearing nothing but a t-shirt underneath. And it's three degrees, two degrees. I think it's two degrees. Wind's blowing. I'm warm <laughs> from the waist up. So this thing is warm. It's got to have some layers in here. I, haven't, I don't know the technical specs on it. But it's got to have some layers in here that blocks out the wind. And I'm not getting wet. So far... It's an awesome hoodie. It's taking us some time to get some cold weather. I've had this for about a month. And uh, we finally got some cold weather. I've been wearing it for about the past two weeks. And so far, i got to say, I'm quite impressed with this bearskin hoodie. Now we just got to find a Christmas tree. Well, we found our tree. I didn't get any video of us cutting it down, which is kind of part of the course nowadays. But they got a neat spot now where you can back your vehicle up to... Uh, Load it into your truck. Sees me having to carry it across the parking lot. So that's what we're gonna do now. We're gonna back up over there and uh, get loaded up and head home. Beer skin hoodie, ha, this is definitely well worth it. I am dry from the waist up, wet from the waist down. That might not have come out right, but that's the way it is. So we got uh, Jen over there getting us some food. Austin's over behind this shed with our tree. I'm going to back up there. We're going to get it loaded up. Get us something hot to eat. And we're going to head home. So this is tradition for us every year to come out here to Sloan's. And it was not looking good at all. Uh, we went bypassed the section we were at last year because it had been picked over. And we went to the next one behind it. And there was just nothing there. On the way back, we found another section closer to Zone Road 7. And uh, apparently... That's the one we should have been at in the first place. So I walked through a whole bunch of mud and got all wet. And it was much closer to the exit and the entrance. So Jenna's always been uh, picky about her Christmas tree. It gets her excited to come out here and look at these trees and find just the right one that she wants. That's all that matters. She says she has to love it. Can't just like it. You got to love it. We got to load it up in the back. We're waiting on our food. We're going to head back home here in a minute. And uh, we start cutting some branches off the bottom and we'll get it set up in the rain all right so my evaluation of this bearskin hoodie i have <laughs> after the past few days i told you this video is going to be all over the place and it was we went on cut some wood at the farm had this on again nothing but a t-shirt and it is pushing zero degrees today and it was pushing three degrees and we were out getting the tree one thing i do really like about this hoodie is there's 12 pockets the bottom down here has got a tie i can make it tighten the waist to keep all the air that's inside here that is warm that is warm keep it warm i'm having trouble with my words today all the air that is inside here will stay warm because we because we tighten up the drawstring also the same with the hood when the hood comes up got drawstrings on the hood is that oh how's that look you can't take me nowhere can you there so when you get the hood up you got drawstrings on the hood you can tighten it right around you and waterproof well proved that yesterday when we were out getting ourselves a christmas tree and it was raining. I mean, it was raining. I did not get wet. And once again, I was wearing nothing but a t-shirt underneath. So would I recommend this hoodie? Absolutely. I'm going to leave a link to their website in the description below. Go check them out. Um, I, I, Again, I was given this hoodie to try out. And we most certainly tried it out in all kinds of conditions. And you guys all know my theory when it comes to people sending me products to try out. You know... And they know that if they send me something and I don't like it, they're going to get a video saying that I don't like it. Full disclosure, I did not pay for this hoodie. Bearskin sent it to me to try out, and I'm glad they did. This is an awesome hoodie. I'll leave a link to their website down below. Go check them out. It is as advertised. Anyway, that's all I got for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed that. Again, I told you it was going to be from one end of the spectrum to the other, and that's exactly what happened. But thank you all for sticking around. 
I appreciate you all very much. We're closing in on 6,000 subscribers. Thanks to you all. Uh, you all? Is that a word? Uh, you all? Thanks to you all. Never ends. See you on the next one. Later.